Metro. And many folks were out tonight enjoying a beautiful night of fun and fireworks. Our Kelly Rule is at Penn's Landing. The waterfront lined up with people to catch the fireworks show. A great start to the holiday weekend. From a safety perspective, we can tell you Philadelphia police had this area barricaded off. They're going to have an increased presence here throughout the weekend. But people we spoke with tonight, so they're just excited to see the festivities all back this summer. I feel really uh, amazing. After a brief pandemic hiatus, the parkway officially looks ready for its 4th of July party. Honey says she's ready to celebrate with the family. I empty my schedule for Sunday, so we're really going to enjoy the 4th of July weekend. They kicked it off Friday night with the Wawa Welcome America Festival's event at Oval XP. Our America Now, expressions of freedom with live performances and personal and historical stories about freedom. We're not the same. We are different, and we have to embrace those differences and welcome those differences, be open to them. It's fantastic. We were actually driving by and we seen it, so we was like, we're stopping so we could come out and have fun. A fireworks show along the waterfront capped off Friday night, and the free events will continue all weekend. Preparations are still underway for the grand finale, the free concert and fireworks display on the parkway Monday. Staff say there will be enhanced safety measures, and all visitors are subject to a search at the two entry points. Everyone is welcome. We invite everyone to come down. We just want folks to be prepared. Now, there are a number of road closures this weekend, especially near the parkway. So if you're coming in, you're encouraged to have a plan first. We have all that information on Fox29.com. At Penn's Landing, I'm Kelly Rule, Fox 29 News.